All right, so maybe you want to simplify your understanding of the political process. Well, with a couple of swipes, a new app is doing just that. Douglas Kennedy live outside our New York newsroom checking it out for us. Douglas? Yeah, John, these days young people have an aversion to traditional politics. It's a situation that's not always helped by social media. It doesn't focus the conversation, doesn't allow you to connect on those issues. For years, Stefan Nicola would update his Facebook page about how he was feeling. But when it came to what he believed, Nicolo kept it to himself. So social media is great at connecting people socially, but it's not always great at connecting people politically. I think with an open platform like Facebook, sometimes it just allows people to go all over the map with your opinions. A fact he says keeps young people alienated from the political process. In fact, less than half of young people today identify with any political party, and less than 20% say they feel politically engaged. Two all time lows in recent American politics. One of the reasons so many New Hampshire millennials flock to non mainstream presidential candidates. People care deeply about issues. And the main reason James Winden co founded Brigade, an app designed to engage young people politically. He calls it the Tinder of politics. So, like Tinder, users swipe their opinions on political issues. Yeah, Brigade makes it easy, fun, and social to be political online. Users, for instance, are presented with provocative questions, swiping agree, disagree, or unsure. Answers immediately put them in touch with like minded individuals for more information and discussion. Now, if users get really involved, you hook them up with national advocacy groups. Exactly. So, on Brigade, you can not only express your opinion on issues that matter to you, but we partner you with organizations so you can take actions to create change. Brigade also encourages young people to write their own opinions, which they can distribute to their friends or to the general public. Today's generation really wants to be able to talk about the issues, connect directly with each other, and perhaps think about things differently. Think about things differently, John, he says, because they're connected differently. That's it from here. Back to you.